I'm Paul Evans, Director Commercial and Industrial at Miles Real Estate. The commercial market has seen some very interesting results in recent months, with a wide array of offerings about to launch into the marketplace between now and the end of the year. Firstly, a couple of results worthy of note include 20 Terracotta Drive in Blackburn, which sold for an impressive $2.61 million, a staggering $5,700 a square metre for a factory in the highly coveted Blackburn Industrial Estate. The auction attracted seven bidders, which is an incredible sign of robust competition for a quality building in any market. 184 Barclay Street, St Kilda has sold after auction for $2.6 million to an owner-occupier. This transaction representing a land value rate of $4,000 a square metre for commercial one zone land. 975 977 Plenty Road in Kingsbury, a vacant corner development site zoned for commercial two, sold for $1.84 million reflecting $1,400 a square metre. Interest rates stabilising over the past few months has injected some confidence in investors and they can now anticipate their cost base for acquisitions a little more accurately for the short to medium term. However, the rate rises over the past 12 months have continued to see a clear softening of yields, which is an obvious flow on effect as banks have tightened their lending criteria for commercial investors in 2023. The land tax changes in 2024, incorporating a lowering of the site value thresholds, will result in every commercial property being impacted. A significant number of strata shops or factories will now incur additional expenses attached, and in most instances cannot be passed on to tenants under retail tenancy legislation. As a result, we anticipate a rise in market rent expectations from property owners during market reviews, and a softening of yields for properties not previously affected by land tax issues that have affected so many people in recent years. Certainly interesting times ahead in 2024. In terms of properties coming to market in the next few weeks, we have some fantastic investment propositions in October and November. We have Ivanhoe Medical Centre at 9 Livingston Street opposite Ivanhoe Plaza with a renewed five-year lease to a long-established medical practice on a substantial parcel of land. With growth in the mid to long term and an annual income of $150,000, this property has price expectations of three to $3.3 million and will go to auction on site in November. 103 to 107 Lower Plenty Road in Rosanna is currently occupied by Australia Post and a well-established pharmacy with total income of $148,000, representing a yield of circa 5%. This is a fantastic set and forget investment opportunity with absolute blue chip tenancies. One Stradbroke Avenue in Heidelberg on the corner of Burgundy Street, an expression of interest campaign closing 10th of November. The property is directly adjacent to Austin and Moringal hospitals and offers 1,100 square metres of mixed-use zoned land. This presents a prime commercial opportunity in the heart of Heidelberg. We also have a range of industrial properties coming up for auction with prices between $600,000 and $1.5 million. It will be a solid run through to the end of what has been an extraordinary year with some interesting ebbs and flows. Land tax issues remain a constant source of discussion, with property investors rearranging their asset structures for the interesting times ahead in 2024. Don't hesitate to approach us to discuss your position or to prepare for an objection if warranted in respect to your land tax in the new year. If you'd like to discuss any aspect of commercial property, whether it's assessing current market rental rates or timing of a potential sale, please don't hesitate to make contact with our team. Thanks for listening.